Oh, good afternoon, everybody. It's Derek at Lockheed's Locksmith Services. Today, we're just going to be talking about um, an ERA center case and how to reverse the anding on a split spindle. So in the UK, we have a lot of these multi-point locks which are controlled by a center case. The handles fit through and they operate by using a spindle, both you know, handles inside, handles outside. But on some of the locks, we have a facility that allows us just to be able to push the door through when it latches on the outside, the handle doesn't actually retract the latch and which keeps the door um, private. It keeps it locked without having to use the cylinder. So how it works is you close the door so it latches over on the split spindle. If you turn the handle on the outside, if you watch the latch, it doesn't operate the latch on the outside. Uh, but it operates as normal on the inside. What you need to do is you need to operate the key to operate the latch and get in. Just a reminder that when it's just left on the latch, it's not fully locked. It's more of a, uh, a privacy thing rather than security. If you shut the door, it latches. If you forgot to lock it, at least it is locked in one position in that you need the key to open the door. The split spindles are this. Uh, they're not universal, so different split spindles are needed for different makes of lock. As I say, this is an ERA one. This works on this. And how it works is it operates, as you can see, it's split in the middle and it operates individually of each half. And when it fits through, you can see a stopper here, which stops it in the right position. You probably can't see that, but in the middle of this spindle all here, it's actually split in the middle, so it operates uh, half and half. So that's fine. But what happens when we come to um, need the door to close that way instead of this way? So if it's closing that way, what would happen is that would be on the inside. And that means that that wouldn't operate the latch. Um, so what do we do to change the ending on this? This is what we need to do. So in order to reverse the handing on this ERA uh, gearbox sort of centre case, you have to take the latch off. And then inside, you'd be changing the latch, taking the latch off anyway to reverse it down. But inside this all here, it's very difficult to see. Let's see if I can operate this a little bit better to... Uh... Right, so inside there is actually a little screw and you have to turn that screw in the opposite direction 180 degrees in order to change the ending of the latch so what i've done now is i've turned the inside screw around put the latch back on so now the door's closing that way and it will actually operate as normal on the inside but on the outside it won't operate the latch. There we go. Um, hope that explains it. It's straightforward once um, you get to know about it. It just can be a little bit confusing when you first put them in. Um, you've swapped it down because it comes out of the factory handed and you've got to change it down. It can be a little bit confusing as to where you actually do it. Thanks for watching. Bye.